Is the new Ordinary Barrier Serum worth all the hype? Let's discuss. With 2% niacinamide, compounds from centella, and other antioxidants, this may aid in reducing oxidative stress and supporting barrier recovery. It gets its pink color from B12, which actually has anti-itch properties. If you have dry, flaky, itchy, irritated skin, this may help you out. I found it a little filmy. It's not the best thing I've ever tried, but it's not horrible either. Fragrance-free, it has an earthy aroma. Should you buy it? If you want to, but how does it compare to just putting a moisturizer on your face? I guess we'll never know.